circumstances tonight, you know, just how proud of you, your team's effort, despite all those circumstances? Uh, yeah, I, I'd say proud is an understatement, you know. It was just uh, injuries just kind of kicking our ass right now, and, you know, next man up mentality, and, you know, those guys stepped in and uh, just did a tremendous job. I mean, they kept us in the game. Uh, you know, I went out for a bit, and then I was uh, came back, and Chuma, uh, TQ, um, Caleb, you know, those guys made huge shots the whole game, made big plays on both sides of the ball, and, you know, gave us a chance to win the game multiple times, and, you know, double over time. So it sucks that, you know, we didn't win. Um, it hurts, but, you know, I can't say enough about what those guys did. Yeah. Uh, for you to put up a career high and, and in spite of all those circumstances, just what was your mentality knowing that you guys were down so many? Yeah, I just wanted to do whatever I could. Um, yeah, really just doing whatever I can, whatever we can, you know, to get the win. Um, you know, we're taking some tough losses, so, you know, we're fighting right now, but, uh, yeah. Uh, how are you feeling, uh, you know, after that one? I'm sure after a lengthy back-to-back, it would be tough anyway, but but after one here, it feels well. Yeah, I mean, we're all, we're all tired. Uh, we knew it was going to be tough just with the back-to-back, getting in late. Uh, but we played, we played a hell of a game, and um, despite everything that still happened with injuries and whatnot, you know, we gave ourselves, ourselves a shot, and that's you know, all we can ask for. You know, you, you and Franz have, have been on an impressive stretch to, to see him go down and you know, have to, to miss the action. You know, just how tough was that to see for him? Yeah, it sucks. Um, you know, just he's, he's a huge part of this team. He's a leader of this team. And, um, you know, when you see him go down in pain, uh, you know, it sucks to see. And, you know, like I said, I just give credit to the guys for stepping in in his place and picking it up. But um, hopefully he gets better, he can get back on the court soon, and uh, we don't need him. When Traveling came in, it seemed like he just fit into the rotation to really help give this team a boost. Just talk a little bit about just how much this bench has just performed and shown up for each other night in and night out. Uh, yeah, I mean, coach, coach just always is preaching next man up. He's been preaching that since his very start. And, uh, you know, TQ, Chuma, those guys, you know, work their tail off every day after practice, before practice. You know, they're getting it in, getting shots up, playing one on one. TQ's going down to the G League, killing. So um, he was ready for his opportunity. You know, he stepped in, and, and that's hard to do. I don't think people realize how, how hard that is to do. You know, when you haven't played with a group, with a team with the whole year. Um, they haven't played any minutes really, and then you just are asked to step in and start the second half, and you know, be a be a winning player. And uh, he just made huge plays the whole game. So you know, we're probably gonna need him again. And uh, yeah, follow up, all around effort from you know, you and your whole teammates. Uh, compared to the last time you was here a year ago, it's been a big turnaround. So when you guys played a, a, a double overtime like this. What that says about the growth of this team? You, you got some young guys. Y'all went against, you know, a team that liked to run up and down the court. And y'all ran up and down the court with them, but you outshot them. And I don't know how much time that y'all touched the paint. But what I meant by growth is the confidence, you know, that they out there. What did that mean about the growth of this team? Yeah, it's, it shows a lot. You know, I think we said before the game, last year we came here, I think we got beat by 30, 40, you know. Um, this is a... a a hard crowd to play, play against, play in front of. They're loud the whole game, every play. Um, you, you know, you feel them, you hear them, and then you know their team feeds off of that energy. Um, and like you said, their play style is hard to keep up with. And um, you know, we we did very, um, very good job, I think, keeping up. And then also, just we got timely stops, we made timely baskets. Um, it kind of reminded me of the game we played last year against them at the start of the year, my rookie year. Kind of a similar type of game where we went in double overtime and shoot, we lost that one too. So, um, yeah, it just shows how much we grew and, you know, we got to keep fighting. Obviously, we would like to win, but, you know, there is something to be said for the growth. But uh, hopefully, we can pull out a win soon. Thanks, everybody. We got to go. Sorry. Thank you.